They almost got me. Almost. I almost believe that Ryu might die. But no, time after time, Bell makes the impossible happen. He makes his ideals into reality. Why? Because he's a hero. Now, we're about to have a pop-off episode, I hope. Remember, remember, who else is still around? The Juggernaut. Is he going to come around? I don't really know. Let's begin today's reaction, though. If the credits are playing in the opening credits without an opening, you know what that means? It means like the... Uh, it's just gonna get real. Anytime there's an episode with that with, where they skip the anime opening, like, oh, it's a, it's a good one. Trying to bury us with bombs. No, 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 no. Bombs, remember, just like what happened. The bombs is trying to elicit a reaction from the dungeon for them to summon something that shouldn't be here, right? This Jira guy, man. Fuck this guy. I hate him so much. Man, it's just an entire sausage fest versus a basically just Amazonian party. Oh, there it is. There's a Juggernaut. And like, Jura himself didn't know it would happen, right? This is just an accident. It's a different color. It's green, I think. Because the one that we saw was more black, I think. Maybe it's a different Juggernaut, I don't know, skin color. And she's dead. Everybody's gonna die one by one. Are we gonna see every one of them get killed? Bro, this is why I said don't get attached to this character in the flashbacks. Like the previous episodes, they've been getting us Astria family flashbacks. I'm like, don't do it. Don't do it. I know what's gonna happen. Don't get attached. Oh my god. How did Ryu get out of this? Like, did somebody like sacrifice themselves for Ryu to get out safe? That's kind of crazy that Ryu would attack it straight on. Knocked out? Wow, Kagwe actually opened their eyes. I mean, shit's getting serious. Oh my god, Kagwe protected her! I'm gonna assume she's dead. Is your arm cut off? What happened? Bro. That's kind of crazy though. Based on how Kagwe and the uh, Ryu's uh, interactions were before. I don't think she will be the type to try and save her, right? He's always be like, be more practical, right? But in that moment, she actually put herself out there. Dude, this magic barrier that this guy has. And right, it reflects. Oh. I think the girl that just got burned alive had the shittiest death so far. This is so twisted. This is so twisted. The shit's popping off. And we knew this would happen. But like, seeing absolute despair in their face. Every one of them getting picked off one by one like this. Just run, please. This is so fucked. How did you get out alive? And Jira actually lives. Of course he does. Like, okay, work. She's kind of still standing. Okay, even in this dire situation, she can crack a joke. But I bet these two make a final stand for them. Oh no, her eyes. Oh. These are the characters that Ryu, I think, was the most close with, or at least from the flashback we've seen. They were the ones that had the most interactions with Ryu. They're gonna protect her so she can live. And even Kaguya, the one that's always so practical, and I didn't think that she would put her life on the line for Ryu. She's doing it. Salute. Like, we knew this was gonna happen. But still, dude, seeing it happen is... Oh. But, okay. So they do end up killing this version of the Juggernaut. I do want to see what kind of magic causes that. Those ideals of yours. I want to see Ryu become a hero too. I don't know if that's safe for Belle, but to make those ideals into reality... Yeah, 
Yeah, we're here. Oh. The funniest thing right now if, is would be if she started walking backwards because she doesn't know where she's going because she's blind. I know it. I shouldn't be making jokes right now. I don't know what that would be funny though. Bye, Kaguya. I won't forget when you call the stupid elf, but salute. Salute. Oh. Bombs? No! To the way that she has to chant the incantation while crying. And this motherfucker's still alive! I hate this guy, even though he's pretty much dead right now, right? I think he fell off the cliff. I think he's dead. I'm not quite sure. What kind of magic is this? Alice. Holy sh... Arvelia. Like, internal damage. I'm not completely sure what Ryu's magic did there, but I think it probably buffed her. No, 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 it's happening now. Do it. She has to use it, and then it killed her too on the process? Okay, it's the same magic that she used on Belle before. Bro, she had to use it on her? Like, she was gonna die, probably. And he lives! He fucking lives! I thought the juggernaut that we're facing right now was like a different variant because the color is different, but... Holy shit. That is a cruel way to end things. That's so cruel. She had to kill her own friends like that. They laid their lives down and it was the perfect sacrifice and then... If that wasn't enough, he got away? You know, now I kind of understand why she acts so distant and alone and cold for in like season one. It makes total sense. It's crazy that we're getting our backstory now. Damn. Even she's telling us that? This is probably not the right time to say, but goddamn, Astrea is thick! She's basically saying go pursue vengeance. But the justice that she championed before, can't it come back with Bell? And Jira's still nowhere to be found. No, there he is! And this is where she gave him the injury, right? Just on the ear. How does he get out of this one? Okay. That's a lot of stabs. How did he live? Why? Why did he live? How? Hmm? Who is this? I don't know. Which god is this? Have we seen him before? Am I forgetting something? Is he one of the evilest family god? Like the evil gods? I don't know. I guess so. But now what? After vengeance. What do you, what do, you do now, right? That's, that's the thing about... Dictate's revenge plot. You achieve your goal. You kill the person you wanted to kill. And then... You feel empty. Your life has no meaning and you fucking... You have no reason to live. Exactly. That's the thing about these vengeance plots, man. Because after... Because it's... that It's just about the chase. And then once you get there, it's just like... Shit, what do I do now? Bell shows up and saves her. Oh, never mind. That's uh. Don't know who this is. Oh, that's right. Then then she went to the bar. Oh, gotcha. And then she became like a like a tavern maid girl, just like in disguise. That's crazy. Someone like someone like as like strong and like dangerous as her, just working in the tavern. No, don't. They're dead and you're alive. That's why there's like this imagery of. The water between them. Bye. You gotta walk your own path, Ryu. No. That's so sad that she just got left behind. Okay, we're back. We're back and we're injured more than ever. 
So we escaped somewhere else, right? Because that's just what Bell does. There's no way he could live with himself if he left you behind. No way. Damn. I wouldn't save you. I mean, you put your life on the line there and sacrificed yourself. I, I could believe that she would. Ryu's probably so worried. Just like before how every one of her friends sacrificed herself, like themselves for Ryu. This is probably just getting flashback, but Bell is different. He's built different. He's got that plot armor on lock. Then believe in my justice. Witness me, Ryu. Bell, come on, show her what the path of true justice is. True, we did a lot of good things together in the previous seasons. There's a lot of good moments in the past. Come on, Ryu. Damn, to Bell, she was the hero. Because to me, you're my hero. Oh, why is she blushing? <laughs> Seeing Ryu blush like that just caught me off guard. It's just, just a little mistakes, you know? We did a little killing. We did a little vengeance plot, but it's okay. Come on. Redemption arc. Find your justice back. Oh. Damn. Everything that she regretted in the past, everything that she doubted, Belle is just confirming that, you know, her existence, her path of justice, it's not too late. You can still live the way that Alice wanted you to live. Damn right. Man, they are bonding. God damn. I just, the real Belle bonding. It's not really a ship. I don't know if there's something romantic here, but god damn, the time we're spending together. Is that the juggernaut? No, okay. Shit. Okay, I was gonna say. <laughs> Hold up. What are they doing? Why would they. Wait. Is there a party nearby to save us or what? No, they wouldn't just kill it off like this. Well, Ryu Clutch? Damn, seeing her cry out Bell like... Okay, so Bell saves us. <laughs> he had me... Wait! It was Bell, right? Okay, okay, okay. I thought they were trying to like set up a scene where like the rest of our party members show up and saves us, but Bell like... <laughs> I got it, don't worry. Oh, look at how shy and embarrassed she's getting for yelling Bell. No, I think everybody wanted to hear her shout Bell like that at least once. Damn. You know, I just was talking about if there was any romantic intent between these two, but like... Seems like this makes me kind of, I don't know, go for the Bell and Ryu ship. I, I don't know. Did you just fall in the water? Okay. Oh, got the... Oh. No. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I, I, I know she's just healing him, but they're getting kind of you know, closed off in the water together like this. Feed it to him, mouth to mouth. <laughs> Missed opportunity, you know, I wanted that mouth to mouth like in CPR, but ah, okay, fine, fine. Didn't expect such a gruesome flashback to end like that. My god, we were expecting for all the Astrea guild to die except Ryu. But holy shit, that Juggernaut's built there. So I guess that is the same Juggernaut back then because the survive compared to now. Man, the Ryu Bell moments, they are special. Holy shit. Like before in the previous seasons too, there's a lot of intimate moments between like uh, all the different characters that we save. Comparing like Haruhime, like Wine and so on, Lily, right? But... Right now, just because it's Bell and Ryu in this despair in the lower floors like this, and like we're trying to like survive, there's something so much more closer. So there's just the bond is just oh my god, am I just actually rooting for this ship? Do they even have a ship? I don't really know what do you guys think. Anyways, if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please subscribe and check out the other videos and playlists on my channel for even more content. And until next time, take care.